Pisces. What's up, y'all? You know I didn't forget about you. First, we're going to pull the Oracle card. Okay? We're going to see what the higher powers that be want you to know. Pisces. Enjoyment, traveling for some of you. Money, patience, forgiveness, being enough, and travel. Okay? Travel. Let every aspect of this trip unfold in harmony. May divine order arrange and handle every detail. I'll be guided easily and follow the leads as they are shown. Travel. Being enough. The innermost heart says, you are enough. Nowhere to go, nothing to get, nothing to change. No need to grow. More deserving. You, yes you, are love. You are enough. Excuse me. Forgiveness. Healing comes from acceptance. Help me, dear Lord, to fully accept what is, knowing that this alone will open me to the new. Forgiveness. Patience. If you've tried forever to shift a problem, there's probably something to learn from embracing it. May I let this be for now. Help me relax and trust every need will be met. Often change soon, soon follows. So be patient. Money. All of my finances are now in divine order. Love itself knows my needs and is the source for all. I needn't cling to gain or fear loss. Every need will be met through offering and all to the, to the divine. So if you have money problems, give it to God and let God fix that for you. I look rough this morning. Huh? <laughs> I don't care. It's not about me. It's about you, Pisces, getting this message. Okay? That's what this is about. Pisces. Pisces. Some of you recently ended something. Maybe with a Taurus. Maybe a marriage. Something you're not looking forward to. You ended something. Something has ended. I don't know if some of you ended a pregnancy. Pisces. I see some of you ended a pregnancy or maybe divorced, ended a marriage or a family. Some of you have realized that you don't want this anymore. Some of you realize, Pisces, that you've been giving too much in this situation and now you are you have exhausted yourself, you have given too much. Maybe some of you have fallen into like a depression and now you're coming back into your spirituality. For some of you, I see that when you came into your spirituality, for some of you, you decided to leave your family. You don't want this anymore. For some of you who are married, you don't want this anymore. Okay? You don't want it. God gave you something. You're like, I don't want this. For some of you, you could be dealing with a Leo 
or a water sign, like a Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio, but I see Leo here. What else do you have for Pisces? Pisces. Okay, for some of you, I see that God is offering you the money. So if some of you have been struggling with money, if some of you have been struggling with money, it's coming in. Okay? Some of you are going through a hard time financially. Okay? I'm taking this as some of you kind of feel like stuck. Maybe some of you are in a relationship here where the person either is just giving you a little bit of money, Pisces. They're not giving you enough money to sustain yourself and your children. There's a lot of conflict about this, okay, Pisces? You don't you, you really don't want to be with this person. You have become very impatient with them. Maybe and when I say conflict, I mean like when you enter in a room with this person, the energy, their energy is really messed up. It's like the energy is so tense in a room that it could like break something, like break a glass. Like that's the, there's tension here. You're not arguing with this person you're not and if you have been in the past like this person gets under your skin okay they get under your skin but I don't see you arguing with this person because some of you Pisces I see that you're in school going back to school you're going higher education you're going higher in your job things like that you don't want to be married to this person some of you Pisces um, this person maybe could have been cheating maybe you were cheating on this person um, there's a lot of distaste for this person in this relationship. And maybe you feel like they're coming out telling you, telling you things. They've come forward with some of their secrets, but they're still hiding something. But for this, I feel like somebody's being real frugal with their money and just giving you a little bit and it's not enough. Anything else for Pisces? I see some of you leaving, okay? Maybe some of you are dealing with a Scorpio. Pisces or Cancer. Pisces or Cancer. Pisces. Pisces. I take this like... Hmm. This is like for me somebody wasn't making you feel like attractive like sexually attracted they act like they're not sexually attracted to you but i take it like you have found confidence or something like that like you right you know you're enough i take it as you're putting yourself on a pedestal you're putting yourself on that high horse where you belong you're saying i know i'm enough i know i belong okay yes Forget that person, Pisces. Whoever that asshole is, forget them. They're a freaking asshole. But there's somebody watching you. You think they're not paying attention to you. There's somebody watching you. I don't take it as the same person. There's somebody else new that is looking at how beautiful you are, Pisces. Your finances are kind of slow right now, okay? They're moving very slow, but that's okay. Because God wants you to know, give him your worries about your financial worries your financial hardships give it to god please pisces because you got the blessing of money coming in okay what else do you have for pisces some of you dealing with a cancer some of you pregnant some of you dealing with a pisces <laughs> another pisces I see you working hard. I see you making plans in the future. Some of you are very disappointed about this situation, especially if you have to leave somebody you've been married to, you're in a relationship, you have children with. Of course, that's very difficult. But I see you guys working hard.
Pisces, I don't see you like, oh yeah, I'm going out to hang out with my friends. We're going to party and this, that, the third. No, Pisces, I do not see you doing that at all. I see you making plans for your future. Some of you may be in a long distance relationship with somebody else. Maybe they don't live by you, close by you. They could live, um, right? I see you traveling. Some of you might even be traveling someplace, okay? Okay, some of you, some of you are traveling. This situation has you disappointed, right? But it's okay, it's okay, because you're gonna pick yourself up, because you know that you are enough, okay? Have patience with yourself, okay? Forgive yourself for this screwed up relationship or marriage that some of you were in. Forgive yourself, Pisces, okay? I see you leaving. It's gonna be a little while, but I see you leaving this person, okay? You're leaving, you're leaving leaving or you're going on a trip for some of you <sighs> your money will be good by that time what else do you have for Pisces some of you dealing with a Taurus Scorpio okay Pisces you might be leaving or making a plan to move forward because some of you might be pregnant okay Pisces some of you have turned up pregnant or some of you have children already okay so this might be a situation where you want to um, take your child and leave this situation. Okay, you're making plans for you and your child. Pisces, this is what I'm getting. This is somebody with, with kids, doesn't have a child. It, it doesn't have to be a biological children, but I see somebody like with one child or something like that. I don't know why. Uh, dealing with a cancer. Or another, yeah. Cancer, Scorpio, another Pisces, all right? Cancer. What else for Pisces? I see you with a Cancer, another word is Leo. Leo, Leo. Either somebody was dealing with the Leo, there's a third party situation going on with a Leo, or Virgo, somebody Pisces. Pisces, Virgo here, and Leo, okay? Maybe you're leaving this person for a Leo or Virgo that makes you happy there's might be somebody else that makes you happy you could be cheating on this person with somebody else that is making you happy it could be you that is in another situation okay oh somebody is pregnant for sure okay pisces okay it's a lot of cards pisces What the heck y'all got going on? <laughs> For those of you who are married, I see that you don't want to be married anymore. For those of you, Pisces, who are in a relationship, I see that you don't want to be in this relationship or you need to have self-care and take care of yourself, okay? For some, I see somebody being very emotional, somebody sad about this. Somebody might be crying about this. Okay, because somebody wants to leave. Excuse me. I see somebody that doesn't want you to leave, Pisces. They don't want you to leave. They could be a Libra, Capricorn, Scorpio, Taurus. Taurus, Scorpio, Capricorn, or Libra. They're sad about this. They don't want you to leave, Pisces. Or you don't want them to leave. Somebody's still trying to make it right. Like, no, 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 no. Like, they're holding on. But I don't see anybody building a future or planning with this person. There's no commit. I mean, somebody wants to be commit committed here, but I don't see the other person wanting this to happen. Somebody's done trying here. But somebody wants wants to make this new somebody made mistakes obviously you have forgiveness somebody made mistakes here in the past i see your money coming through for those of you who are waiting on a job offer is coming look out for the letter the phone call is coming pisces because you probably feel upside down about something pisces for some of you you are pregnant and you don't want to be you don't want to be because you're in a third-party relationship. 
For some of you, there's somebody, there's definitely somebody cheating. You could be dealing with a fire sign or earth sign. For some of you, the person you're dealing with is just not balanced. They could have some kind of addiction or something like that. They're just not faithful. They're not faithful, okay? Pisces. Pisces. This is you. I'm not sure which way this card fell. I take it like either you don't love someone or someone wasn't treating you right in this situation, Pisces. Somebody's got a lot of darkness with them. A lot of negative energy with them. Somebody's having a hard time being able to move on. Somebody's having a hard time being able to move forward and put their foot down. Okay? Somebody's also very hot-headed, hot-tempered. Okay, somebody's over sex and over overly sexual. Okay, somebody's a major flirt in this situation dealing with a fire sign. For those of you dealing with a fire sign, be careful with this person because they do have a temper. They're probably abusive, Pisces, this fire sign that I'm talking about. The person could be abusive, so please be careful. You might be feeling you might be dealing with an Aries and you might feel like. You're struggling with this person and you haven't made a decision. For some of you dealing with Aquarius or some of you, you don't have faith to move forward. You don't know what to do. You really feel stuck. Okay, this person is the father of your children you, or husband. Okay, but you're, you're struggling with something with this person. Some of you, I think, are struggling with abuse within your relationship, Pisces. And that's another reason why you want to leave. Give me more. You got to cut this out. You got to cut it out. Some of you, you don't know how to walk away, but then you're not happy. Some of you are too strong, too smart, but you're being foolish. Because there's betrayal in this relationship. Some of you are spending a lot of time just wasting your energy being sarcastic and nasty and being pity. They get back and forth with the person you need to stop. You're not happy, Pisces. For some of you, you are not happy. I'm so sorry about this reading because somebody is just not happy. Anything else you have for Pisces? Some of you could be dealing with an Aquarius. Or an Aquarius is going to help you in this situation. There's going to be help. You're going to get the help. So some of you are going to get the help to go back to school or to get a job. Aquarius or Leo. Some of you might find a Leo that is your soulmate, okay, Pisces? It might be a Leo or Leo in the chart. Or you're going to get the courage to find your soulmate. Could be a Gemini, okay? It's happening whether you like it or not because you have divine intervention. It doesn't matter what you say or do. It doesn't, it doesn't matter because it's going to happen regardless, okay? Now, I have to make these videos kind of short. I don't have a lot of time. You need to have patience. Let me pull one more card for you guys. Okay? Pisces. Lovely Pisces. Pisces. Come through, Pisces. Come through. Some of you dealing with a Libra. Okay? Perception. Your third house, speech, thoughts, social media, excursions, dating, siblings, research, street life, circulation, discussions, surroundings, and being social, okay? Then you have trine, flow, harmonizes, aids, enriches, benefits, energizes, enjoys, eases, lubricates, gifts, rhymes supports and indulges so for some of you you're going to be finding somebody else who's going to really help you through this situation that you're in you need to go with the flow um your perception okay 
This could be how your 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 appearance online on social media, okay? How you act outside in the street. It's probably not it's probably not matching how you feel, what you're really going through. Um, for some of you, you're not telling people what you're going through. But you need to start speaking up, especially those of you that are in an abusive relationship. You need to start speaking up. Also, pay attention to your surroundings. Watch your surroundings. Um, be careful in the street, okay? For some of you, you need to watch your back. Okay. Yeah. Watch your back. And if you have family you could reach out to, like brothers or sisters, close friends, reach out to them. For some of you, you're going to be dating and doing things like that. For some of you, there's somebody new who's really going to be, like I said, your soulmate, your twin flame. Okay. Who's going to just take your mind away from all this crap. It's a lot of crap going on. For some of you have someone bringing you gifts. Some of you have someone who really supports you. Pisces, I love you. Okay? Really keep your head up. Keep your head up. Your money's coming. You're leaving the situation. Go with the flow. Perception is everything. God bless. Take care.